Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Eva and I would love if you hit that subscribe button down below. Also like this sort of video if you obviously like the, these uh, type of videos and turn on the notification bell. And if you're all to this channel, welcome back. So I decided after seeing a couple of these videos on YouTube that I'm gonna give it a go and I'm gonna eat and work out as a Victoria's Secret model for the whole week. So seven days trying to follow their diet. Obviously uh, I'm not saying this is exactly how Alessandra Ambrosio eats or Romy Street but what I did is firstly I watched some of the videos. I also fully follow Romy Street here on YouTube so I kind of know her schedule that she works out quite a lot um, and I also gathered and wrote down from different interviews ideas for breakfast lunches dinners to be to be uh, quite honest it was a lot of fish a lot of protein like chicken and always salad on the side and i'm like if you tell me tonight i need to have a salad and chicken i'll probably be like oh please don't stop i need some pasta but anyway guys i did it i've tried my best considering i'm also looking after uh, my son Liam full time so there was a lot of running with the buggy uh, but I did work out six days in a row with one rest day and um, I finished on high at KXC London gym and I did a very very hard uh, boxing class which was called knockout and yeah that was tough I'm not surprised uh, the girls are so skinny because obviously it's the genetics in terms of their body shape and if they push themselves so much and follow this sort of diet there's no way <laughs> they're not gonna be that sort of shape it was hard and also a um, couple of things I wanted to mention so I was drinking a lot of hot water with lemon which I do anyway but I kind of edit uh, more during the day I was drinking a lot of water probably around three maybe even more liters a day so that is crucial I was still drinking coffee for example Romy Street she drinks her coffee she drinks it black I can't do that so I was adding some soya milk. At the end of the day I am not a Victoria's Secret model and I need at least something in my life that I love <laughs> as it was quite hard. Um, another thing I want to mention I lost probably around three pounds. I definitely felt really good. I felt my skin is really good because ultimately there's a lot of things that are superfoods you know beetroot and uh, berries and, and obviously that helps you to detox your body. Um, I felt a little bit more tired than other weeks um, it could be partially because Liam wakes up at five so it was quite tough for me to keep up with everything and with the level of workouts and eating so healthy when you've been up probably since five um, and another thing is um, I wanted to mention is that I wasn't that hungry to be honest I wasn't that hungry it's more you know the freedom to have more variety I think you would really need to go out and eat a lot like in healthy places so for example on Sunday which was the last day um, I kind of went a little bit wilder so after the class we went to Granger's um, near Sloan Square and I had an amazing salad with quinoa and I know it was all super healthy there was nothing bad in the salad maybe the halloumi cheese but I see some of the models eating like feta cheese um, here and there in their salads so I don't think it's necessarily that bad and it was super delicious so sometimes the preparation if you want to keep a bit of variety can be quite time consuming um, so I can definitely recommend guys if you want to maybe uh, find out more I'm going to link everything down below try to maybe even uh, put together the ideas for lunch breakfast dinner everything I gathered. I'm also going to link down Romy's channel if you guys want to have a look because I actually followed one of her workouts and also another model that walked Victoria's Secret show a few times which is Sane Vloa. She's got some amazing workouts and recipes. I didn't want to cook one of her um, uh, chicken curry recipes but I just didn't get around to actually source all um, all the stuff that needs to go in it so I decided not to go for it so hopefully you guys enjoy this video I basically filmed it Monday to Sunday and I'm gonna insert the clips now so thanks very much for watching and hopefully you like this so first day Monday and um I start this morning like this pretty much any time anyway. So I start with hot water, lemon and a coffee. I've noticed a lot of Victoria's Secret models, um, especially I've noticed in Romy's walk, she drinks black coffee. I can't handle black coffee. So I'm going to add some uh, soya milk, which I just frothed in my milk frother. 
and for today breakfast I'm gonna have some oats and um, this is a slightly changed recipe that Romy Street is um, has shown on her um, channel on YouTube um, but she adds basically a protein powder which I don't have so I just had these soaked in overnight I'm gonna add some peanut butter some nuts and some berries so hopefully it's gonna be yummy it looks delicious so let's dig in hey guys and it's time for lunch so uh, this is my Monday lunch um, I kind of created a list of recipes from different articles what I read what Victoria's Secret models would eat and obviously there's a lot of salads one of them had like avocado and some lettuce and also some feta cheese to kind of like add a bit of flavor to it so I thought I'm gonna create something similar these are red peppers cucumbers spring onions and then as a dressing I used lemon olive oil and a bit of, bit of vinegar and that's it salt and pepper so yum yum very very healthy lunch a la Victoriosi and of course I'm gonna have it with a glass of water because they always drink a lot of lot of water which I drink anyway I kind of like sparkling but actually some of them they do drink sparkling for example Romy in all her videos so I'm glad I can do that as well I may put a slice of lemon in it and perhaps later on this afternoon have more hot water with lemon so yum yum and if you're eating as well bon appetit so this is what I decided to have for snack uh, I mean um, again all the options I found in different interviews and articles are gonna be written down below but um, I think watermelon is a very nice juicy healthy snack obviously some people may say there's a lot of sugars but I believe if it's natural sugars your body will definitely use it in the right way so yeah it's around 2.30 now, so it's been two and a half hours since I had lunch and it's really recommended to eat smaller portions more often. So yeah, let's have this snack and then do the work. And it's time for Monday workout. So uh, my normal schedule when it comes to working out is basically the Kyla Itzine BBG program which I've talked in my previous videos and because I don't want to interrupt that and I want to continue doing it I'm gonna do that workout which is 28 minutes it's a circuit type of exercise where you predominantly work with your own body weight and then I'm gonna add extra 15 minutes um, a bad workout which you can actually find on Romy Street a Victoria's Secret model a channel on YouTube and it's specifically designed by her so I'm gonna follow that as an extra on the top of my regular workout so let's do this let's just do what you want to please don't be polite cuz I like your attitude let's forget about a curve all that is stuck in my head It's me and you All speed in my heart is racing But I'm not sure I wanna place it Cause it only does this with you Our bodies meet, I can feel the tension Move us into the next dimension Let's just let our bodies be true We make out for the thrill of it Mess Okay, and this is my dinner It's now actually quite early It's 5.30 I'm so hungry I decided to have dinner a little bit earlier so I'm having just salmon with some herbs and roasted vegetables just whatever I had at home some asparagus red onions peppers and courgettes which I put a little bit of lemon on it salt pepper and olive oil and just roasted it like that and I think I mixed in like chopped garlic as well to give it a bit of flavor so bon appetit that's my first day eating as Victoria's Secret models Tuesday and it's second day of Victoria's Secret model diet and workouts and um, I actually started my day uh, as per usual with a um, cup of hot water with lemon and also coffee the same as yesterday and I'm also going to repeat the breakfast uh, just because I want to use the berries I have and all the ingredients so I'm going to go for the oats with soya milk uh, and with the berries and a spoon of peanut butter so Let's start a day and um, can I just say also like the 
the breakfast really really filled me up whilst um, for then the rest of the day just after eating salad I felt when I don't have any carbs not even anything like a rye bread or anything like that that I was a bit hungry then towards the end of the day but I feel good now again in the morning so yeah And this morning when it comes to workout, I'm gonna try this 10 minute ab workout by uh, San Vloa that was um, a Victoria's Secret model and um, is highly recognized model. So let's try and then I'm gonna add um, a run, but it looks like it's gonna rain now. So probably gonna go in the afternoon. And I'm just gonna have another hot water and lemon after that abs workout and just do a bit of work. And this is Tuesday's lunch. Basically, this is not a specifically Victoria's Secret recipe, but in a lot of the interviews and articles, beetroot was one of the vegetables that was basically consumed a lot. And it's one of the healthiest, and probably it's one of the healthiest thing you can actually give into your body. And I've been doing this recipe for a while since I found it in a very healthy store. I bought like one of the small pot salads, which was, and I actually do this quite a lot and it's super tasty. So all you need is to cut boiled beetroot, beetroot. Um, you need peas, I usually use frozen peas, and then um, a bit of feta, salt, pepper, and you squeeze a lemon on it and pour a bit of olive oil and it's super delicious and super healthy. So bon appetit! So I just finished my run, I was running with the buggy and now it's time for the last part of Tuesday workout and that is some skipping, as you know, probably. Adriana, Adriana Lima swears on skipping, so let's do that. I'm not the best, but every little counts. And this, my dear friends, is my Tuesday dinner. I've actually copied this salad. Um, I've had this in Polpo at UK Square and it's basically just rucola with a thinly sliced courgette um, you drop a lemon on it or squeeze lemon on it, salt, pepper and olive oil and they had parmesan in it I'm just gonna have it with one chicken breast it is one but I just sliced it to make it thinner and uh, pan fried it so bon appetit The super healthy Wednesday breakfast, scrambled eggs, salmon, fresh uh, spinach and brown rice. So um, this is a combo, um, sometimes with avocado maybe instead of spinach. I read um, Victoria's Secret models eat a lot for breakfast. I guess this is a healthier version of carbs and I'm glad the rice is in there. <laughs> Otherwise I would be hungry um, because the oatmeal actually does fill you up. So I want breakfast to fill me up that I feel energetic and not starving basically. So I've already had my hot water with lemon and also my coffee. So I'm just gonna enjoy this with a glass of water. I'm heading out soon and I'm gonna go and shoot in West London. And because I think we're gonna be there over lunch and I want to make sure I'm not gonna eat anything bad, I've actually prepared some carrots and I'm gonna take a pot of hummus with me just to get by by the time I'm actually gonna get home and I'm able to cook fresh lunch. But in the worst case scenario, if I would eat somewhere, I would probably choose a salad, but hopefully it's not gonna come to that. And I also have my swell bottle with water. It keeps it nice and chilled and fresh. So off we go. Guys, it's... 3.15 and I only got home so I'm so glad I brought the carrots with me otherwise I would probably pass out but anyway I'm having a late lunch and I'm having the same as I had for dinner because it's super delicious and it actually did fill me up so I thought why not to have more tasty food and I had still all the ingredients so bon appetit Wednesday and sadly I have to say I didn't manage to fit in a workout uh, as you can see, I'm in my workout gear, but my mum called and we had a very, very long Skype call and then I had to cook dinner for him and I have to now get him ready for bed and then just do other bits. So I'm going to take this day as a rest day and I'm going to continue tomorrow. So I should be doing tomorrow a run and the Kyla It Signs workout and I also should be going to um, then Friday, I should be doing Kyla It Signs and I think run. 
and then weekend I should be going to do probably some workout classes so I don't like this <laughs> myself but today was just so sporadic uh, and I don't like excuses but I know rest day anyway is important so why not to swap things around and I'm also thinking what about dinner because Again, the whole schedule went just out of the window today with me having later lunch and I don't really feel hungry, but I know I can't go starving to bed. So I need to figure out what I'm gonna have, um, but probably won't be anything big. Um, not sure I'm gonna be having maybe like meat or maybe either like a salad or avocado and something. So I need to think of that. It's not easy, guys, this Victoria's Secret model diet life. <laughs> uh, right, so I just decided something like this, just for a plain yogurt with some nuts. This is gonna be my dinner. I really don't fancy anything big, and not sure if this is right, but it will have to do. Good morning, I'm just preparing my breakfast for Thursday, so I'm going for oats with berries and nuts, but today I'm going to add some flax seeds in it, maybe like a spoon, um, just to get something really good in my body. So bon appetit guys if you're eating, and I'm starting the day actually very, very healthy. <laughs> so that is Thursday workout done, I did... Uh, one of the parts of Kayla It Signs, the one that goes on Wednesday. Can't remember which week, but it was basically abs and arms, which definitely are my weak area. My, my legs are stronger. And then I did follow with the 15 minute workout that's gonna be linked down below, uh, down by a Victoria's Secret model, Romy Street. It looks quite easy, it's only 15 minutes, but trust me, you definitely will feel your butt. Uh, you will sweat a little bit as well, so that's a good workout and that's my second time I've added that to my usual routine this week. So I'm gonna go and have a shower and I'll see you guys later, I guess, when I'm eating my lunch. <laughs> I just got back from uh, Central and this is what I'm gonna have for lunch. Sorry guys, this again because I got obsessed with this combination, but today I'm gonna have it with some smoked salmon and I'm gonna cook um, a cup of brown rice. So that's my lunch. I also got on the way some coconut water. I'm not a huge fan, but I know a lot of Victoria's Secret models edit, so I said, why don't I edit in this week, even if it's just once or twice. For this is probably the least exciting dinner, but I got home quite late and didn't think through this. So I've got some cucumber that is sliced with salt, pepper, and a bit of olive oil and chicken breast. So one of the few guys, and that's Thursday dinner. And happy Friday, guys. So this morning I'm gonna have a Alpro Simple Yogurt with some flax seeds, berries and nuts. It's probably around 11 and I'm having this as a snack because it's probably way too early to have lunch and I feel like the breakfast wasn't as filling as for example the rice with salmon I had the other day or the oats. Uh, so this is a kohlrabi and some cucumber and a bit of hummus and then I need to think what I'm gonna have for lunch. And guys, this is my Friday lunch. Um, so I'm having again one chicken breast, but I always half it to um, just to make it thinner and easier uh, to make. And then I'm having some greens, and this is a spinach um, with a garlic. So guys, Friday treat for snack. I'm having some pineapple. Apologies for no makeup, but I was like, I'm not gonna even bother. Oh, this is yum. And say hello to my Friday dinner. I'm treating myself a little bit. So I've got quite a lot of prawns on there and also a bit of sprinkle of the Parmesan on the salad. Ah, and it's all steamy, it's just fresh. <laughs> so hopefully this is gonna be nice. I'm sorry again about this combo, but I got obsessed with it. And I can be like that, that if I like the taste of something, I can eat it several days in a row and I know it's healthy, it's good for me and it's probably you know what people will recommend to eat anyway. So bon appetit for dinner guys if you're eating and I'm off to enjoy. This is my breakfast on Saturday. So I'm having oats, some flax seeds, peanut butter, the usual as 
compared previously but today I swapped for banana and the blueberry. On my second cup of coffee today I'm just a little bit tired this week I don't know if it's the what I eat maybe my body getting used to it but I was thinking because every time I remember when I used to detox and that I would get really tired uh, obviously the body doesn't get the same kind of nu nutrition as normally when I say nutrition I mean the sugar the carbs um, and I'm almost thinking is it the same but it could also be that Liam keeps waking up really early this week and I didn't have many naps with him but anyway this is my second cup of coffee and then I'm gonna go for a run I'm taking Liam today as well so it's gonna be a run with a buggy as always <laughs> So this is going to be my lunch on Saturday, just because I was having up with Liam and I have to rush somewhere, so I don't really have time to cook. Um, he's going to have some soup, uh, but for now this will have to do for me. So it's a yogurt, banana berries and nuts. I'll show you what I'm going to have for dinner on Saturday. It's a little bit probably bigger portion, also considering I already had a smaller portion of this earlier on when I was in town. But then I was thinking the lunch wasn't that big, I didn't have any snack on, so I got sushi. Uh, mainly out salmon and avocado and I've got some edamame beans as well, which should be good. But I thought it's Saturday night, I don't have to cook and it's yummy i love sushi and i'm i know a lot of the models say they would eat without the rice but at the end of the day guys i deserve this i deserve a bit of rice in this uh, crazy week <laughs> of being so healthy and working out like crazy so yeah a little cheat dinner slash um, snack anyway <laughs> bon appetit to me Good morning and happy Sunday guys. Finally the last day of me eating like a Victoria's Secret model and this is going to be my breakfast. So I've got scrambled eggs, uh, avocado with a bit of um, lemon juice and some uh, chilies, a bit of salmon and I am <laughs> very hungry. <laughs> so I'm going to add these two corn thins. I haven't read that um, in any of kind of the Victoria's Secret models interviews that that's what they would eat but I've seen it in other people's videos about eating like Victoria's Secret models so I thought why not it's Sunday I actually did wake up this morning with really really flat tummy uh, which was obviously really good news so <laughs> there is definitely something about eating like that but I'm not gonna ramble on now eat this and then Let's see what workout I'm gonna do today and what I'm gonna eat later. Guys, so I'm currently in Chelsea and heading for a class into the gym, which is called KXU. Prince Harry goes there, by the way. Natasha saw him there. And a lot of uh, celebs as well. But anyway, I'm basically gonna do a class which is called Knock. And it's basically things like drills, boxing, and stuff like that. I won't lie, I'm pretty scared because I've been up since 4.45 this morning and my energy levels are not great so yeah, it will be challenging but it's the last day of my Victoria's Secret model training and eating challenge so let's do that Okay, we just finished the class guys, I hope you can hear me but it was tough Natasha wanted to kill me second time but what a way to finish this Victoria's Secret week of training and eating challenge it was like a proper boxing class a lot of drills and there was like no break whatsoever so i don't know if i'll be able to move tomorrow but anyway we're going to stop at rangers just have something to eat so i'm gonna probably go for one of the salads i'm gonna show you which one i'm thinking and I'm gonna go for the Bills beads, which is a beetroot, carrot, fennel, and apple juice. So this is my salad, guys. There's some quinoa. Unfortunately, a bit of cheese, but I thought it's Sunday, so I'm gonna treat my. So this is my last meal, and this is an octopus salad, which I just got on delivery. It looks super healthy. It's got some celery, carrots, and obviously octopus. 
a bit of dressing which looks like very olive oil based. Hopefully guys you enjoyed uh, the clips and hopefully that inspired you maybe to take on a challenge. I thought that's a nice challenge. I'm going on holidays soon so I thought that could be that last push before holidays. Um, obviously I haven't lost because it was only a week uh, a massive amount of weight and I'll probably may gain it back if I don't keep up <laughs> at least reasonably with the food and workouts. Um, I do work out quite a lot but obviously not into such an extent. I work out probably four times a week. I do a bit of running and I also follow Kayla Itzain's uh, workout program as well which is brilliant especially when you don't have enough time and you've got kids. It's really really good. Uh, but I'm glad I did it. Um, I felt really good. I felt it was an achievement. Obviously for them it's a way of living and um, eating like that. Um, there were a couple of things I really missed and that was definitely to have my glass of wine in the evenings which I absolutely love and and also because the weather is so amazing in London you know the social drinking you know it's all about now drinking gin and tonic you know on the on the beautiful beer gardens and all the cafes so I kind of miss that but hopefully I can loosen up a little bit I can have my beloved beautiful wine uh, or champagne now and I'm gonna keep working out guys follow Kayla it signs and obviously try to eat as healthy as possible I'm not saying I'm gonna keep that up on the holidays but I'm still really glad I did it so guys if you like this please hit that subscribe button thumbs up and notification bell I would love that and let me know if you want uh, more maybe workout videos or how to stay fit especially when you're a mom and um, you know you don't have enough time and you perhaps sleep deprived sometimes like me um, but it is doable guys so thanks very much for watching and thank you i'll see you in my next video bye